always like to come to this fair. I love it when you guys say that you're coming just to see us. I did. A thankful Carla Crawford, one of the more than 20 native vendors that made their way to the Duwamish Longhouse and Cultural Center in West Seattle Saturday to showcase their love for their culture. We are alive and we are thriving from back from the ancestors. We're coming out more and more and being vocal, singing our songs and, and doing our dances and performing. This marks more than a decade of this annual native art market with a focus on supporting native owned businesses and artists, not only from Washington, but from throughout the country. To show our work, to, to to show our art style and our culture to people that may not normally ever come in contact with that. The weekend long event is also a chance to reconnect with old friends after a difficult few years dealing with the pandemic. And sharing my art with all my friends that are here, which I've known for many, many years and doing this show for many, many years, it's like coming home and seeing everybody again. So very, very good, good feeling. Native vendors like Garda P. and Crawford hope people will continue to support the native community not just during events like this, but year-round. Ask them where they're from, how they got started, their the history of themselves. You always learn something new every day. In West Seattle, Brady Wakayama, King 5 News.